the space mean speed, SMS, is the average speed of vehicles over space. The space mean speed is the recommended speed for use in the highway capacity manual procedures. And if you're thinking about how it relates to the TMS or the time mean speed, the time mean speed is typically slightly larger than the space mean speed and commonly by less than a couple of percent. We do have a couple of equations for space mean speed, one that looks at its relationship with flow and density, and one that looks at actual observations of speed and time over some length, roadway length. So our U sub S, that's our space mean speed in miles per hour. L is the segment length, typically in miles if we're using English units. T sub I is a travel time of the individual ICE vehicle measured over a roadway segment, typically again in hours. Q is the equivalent hourly flow in vehicles per hour, so that's the first equation or the one on the left. Flow is the density times space mean speed, so Q equals K times U sub S. And N is our sample size or just the number of vehicles observed for our individual travel times. Taking a look at an example, we have a speed study that collected speeds from eight vehicles at a fixed point. 45, 50, 39, 47, 41, 49, 42, and 47 miles per hour for those eight observations. If we were actually doing a speed study, we'd have many more speeds, but this will help us uh, work through this particular example. The speeds were collected on a roadway segment that has, a consist that has consistent speeds for the three-quarter of a mile segment, and we're asked to find the space mean speed. So the first thing we have to do is each time must be computed to solve the problem. So we need to find that travel time. And again, this assumes that those speeds are consistent over that entire 0.75 mile segment. So we're just going to divide the distance by the speed. So 0.75 miles divided by 45 miles per hour for the first case gives us a T1 of 0 0.01667 hours. Same thing for the next one. So T2 is 0 0.015. T3 is 0 0.01932 hours. T4 is 0 0.0159. This takes us to T5, 6, 7, and 8. Those are all the same process. We're just computing the time uh, that it takes T1 through to T8. Now we can solve for our space mean speed. So starting with our equation where the space mean speed is equal to our sample size times the length over the sum of the individual travel times. So U sub S, our space mean speed is equal to eight times 0.75 miles over the summation of those eight travel times. We're gonna get U sub S, the space mean speed is eight observations times 0.75 miles divided by a total travel time of point. 134268 hours gives us a space mean speed of 44.687 miles per hour, and that is answer A.